What's going on, everybody? This is Coach Anthony with the First Tee of Greater Philadelphia. Um, today we will be talking about putting and our core value courtesy. Um, with that being said, I hope everybody is being safe right now with this time that is going on. Um, following proper protocol, uh, whatever you need to do to be safe. As a golfer myself, I'd love to be outside on the golf course right now, but um, it's better off that we practice our social distancing. Um, so bear with me with this process. This is my first time doing this, so hopefully you guys learned a few things and uh, we'll go from there. Um, now today our core value will be courtesy. Um, obviously, wherever you may be doing this, I'm inside the pro shop here. Um, we have to make sure that we're able to do this. So be courteous, ask your parents, guardians, whoever it may be, if you're able to practice your putting inside the house, inside the home, um, wherever it may be, okay? Um, courtesy, for me, um, it's being very considerate to whoever it may be. Um, now, I like to treat people the way that I wanna be treated. So being polite, being gentle, asking questions, especially in this time right now, I think it's important for all of us to be very courteous to each other. Maybe call up on an old friend, um, an older relative that you may have, check in on how they're doing, see if they need any help with anything that's going on. Um, just remember to be safe at a time like this. Um, and hopefully we're back to normal soon, but for the time being, um, our nine core values will be very helpful in this time of need, um, especially the core value courtesy. Um, now today, what we'll be doing is some putting. Now, after I asked my um, director of golf, Sean Ketchum and Rebecca Camano, if I was able to putt inside the pro shop here, they gave me the okay. So I think it's ready to go for us. Um, now today, simple, don't really need too many supplies. I'm gonna take this foam with me. Um, as you can see here, I'm gonna try to change this around, but the only supplies I need is a putter. Now I like to use three golf balls. So I have three golf balls here. Now, if you want to check my setup, uh, very important. This is no pun intended, but my target today will be this bottle of Lysol right here. Okay, very circular, looks like a golf hole. So we're gonna act like that is our hole today. Um, now also, what we'll be doing is I have pencils that line up my different distances as you may see right there, okay? Now, in golf, very important to practice our short putts. Um, I have three foot, I have a three foot, foot putt lined up right here, a six foot putt and a 10 foot putt. Now, ideally, I think we're gonna hit three balls at this target each. And I'll probably do 10 different um, sets of three from each spot. So a total of 90 putts, okay? Um, now I like to make three in a row. If not, it's okay. Learn from it and figure out what we need to do to improve each and every time. All right, so I'm gonna set my camera up for a second. Um, we're gonna roll some putts, hopefully you can see me. Um, and afterwards, I'll, I'll go over what I felt and what I felt this did for me, all right? Give me a second here. Now I'm gonna simulate this. I'm gonna do just three from this spot right here, okay? So always make sure you get comfortable, get practicing. Now I'm gonna to try to hit this nice old bottle. Oh, 0 for one. All right. Not too bad, two for three. Now, I would do that 10 more times for a total of 30 putts, okay? I'm gonna skip through that right now. If you guys are following along, you can um, pause this video right here, maybe take 30 putts at this spot, and then work your way back to the six foot putt. Now, what I did, I have, uh, my measuring stick was my feet, okay? So I worked my way back from the can of lace hole, three feet, put the first pencil down there, um, step back another three feet, put another pencil down there, and then another four for the last spot. Okay, so I'm gonna move back to the six foot putt. Hopefully you can see me.
Now we really want to work on our speed here as well, okay? It's not just aiming at a target. We want to make sure that we're able to two putt from any position here, okay? Not too bad. All right, now I'm not going to go back to the 10 foot spot uh, for those that are watching. I hope you guys make your way back to 10 feet. Um, I think it was a little bit outside my video camera here. Um, but the importance of these putts um, can make or break a golf round. Now, anything inside of 10 feet, I like to think as a makeable putt. Doesn't mean we're going to make it every single time, but they're very important to practice. Um, with that being said, we never like the three putt, okay? So always make sure you, you get your target, you read your putt, um, and you get a good feel of the speed, okay? Um, last but not least, I hope everybody's being safe at this time. Please make sure you review what courtesy means to yourself first. Um, figure out what it means to you, how you can use it in everyday life. Um, hopefully we're back in school soon. And I know courtesy is a very big part of what we do every single day. Um, but other than that, be safe, follow this, keep track of your putts, okay? Uh, keep track of every single position that you're at. Keep how, how many you make from three feet, how many you make from six feet, and how many you make from 10 feet, okay? Because we'll be doing this in a couple weeks again, and we'll try to figure out our process, our progress, and see how well we did the first time from the second time. It's always about um, the end goal, okay? So make sure we're keeping track of how our progress is at all times. And hope we get better and better each day. And then we'll be able to return out to the golf course. Everybody be safe. Um, hope you're watching this. Hope you're doing okay. Um, please make sure you ask your parents or guardians before you do this drill. Um, other than that, I am Coach Anthony. Hope everybody's safe. Be careful.